everyone, this is Brandon Prime, and I'm here to give my thoughts on the KSI vs Swans and Pineda fight. I watched it last night, and man, I was impressed. I was very impressed, but the person that I am most impressed with is Deji. He actually won. He was he won his first professional fight. First professional fight against Fuzi and that. I guess all the trash talking was just over and done with as soon as the fight happened. Because you know what happens with trash talking and all that shit. Once you're in the ring, it all gets settled. So I'm assuming so. And then obviously, we have other... We have other fighters. So, Pappy, fucking hell. First round knockout. Impressive, very impressive. I'm very impressed with that dude. You know, he really does he really does deserve that win. First round knockout, that's incredible. Very incredible. Now, King Kenny versus Sensei. Mm, I think uh Faye Sensei was robbed. In my personal opinion, I think he was robbed. Cause he seemed to have done more of the boxing fight than I thought, like, than anyone thought, really. Like, Keemstar, True Geordie even fought it. That, uh, Face Sensei needed the win, but it was robbed from him, so that's a bit disappointing, so it might just get overturned. Even King Kenny noticed that he might, it might get overturned. And then, Slim versus Face Temper. Jesus Christ, Slim really surprised me. Jesus Christ, I was not expecting him to knock him down like that fucking hell man you are really strong I think what we need now is another fight we need a brand new fight also let me just say the final fight with KSI and Bonita respect to both of them for stepping in the ring but Jesus Christ Bonita <sighs> seriously what the hell is wrong with you, you you're a joke you kept fucking complaining about JJ hitting you in the back of the head when there were certain points where he didn't even fucking hit you in the back of the head. You were just being a little whiny baby about it. Jesus Christ. Man up and just fight. You didn't put up very much of a fight. You're a fucking pro boxer for God's sake. And yet, you whine like a little baby. Anyways everyone, that was just my opinion. Like, it was an incredible event. It's, I'll tell you what, I'm very impressed. Very impressed. And the fact that bloody uh, Jake Paul thinks he's better than everyone, and that better than cares, like, fuck off are you, Jake. You ain't better than anyone. You got your event cancelled. You are a bloody joke. I believe you sabotaged the Alex Wasabi fight with JJ. So, Alex Wasabi. I now send this message to you. You pulled out. You had a head injury. I don't know if that's true because you were back in the gym in no time. But I don't think JJ is going to give you that opportunity to fight him again because you missed out on the chance to fight him. You're just even more of a fucking joke than you already are. Yeah, you may have beaten Deji, but Deji fucking won against Foodie now. And that was his first pro fight. Proper pro fight. You've not even done a pro fight yet. So, until until you get a pro fight, you're just a fucking joke, Wasabi. Seriously, don't don't fucking humble yourself so much because you're just a fucking joke. And I know a lot of you are gonna go. Nah, 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 nah. Well, yes, I'm a KSI and Deji fan. Always have been, always will be. And Logan Paul, wow. I'm glad to see he's there, and he's supporting JJ and all that, and then he calls him his best friend. That's that's so heartwarming and nice to see. I think a good fight would have to be Salt Pappy versus Slim. I think that is a worthy fight. And then I think Dean the Great needs to fight FaZe Jarvis. Even though FaZe Jarvis wasn't in the event or hasn't done boxing for a little bit, I still think he should fight Dean the Great. It just makes sense. It seriously does. 
Anyways, that was just my opinion on the event and my reaction and all that. Very well fucking done to Deji. Just well done. Anyways, I think that'll leave it here. This is Brandon Prime signing out saying, if you like this video, you know, hit that like button. And if you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And then turn on the notification bell if you want to stay notified when I next upload. And stay primed, everyone, and I will see you later. Oh, <laughs>